Go on, do it. Do it. On a yeah. farm in the Ngong area, close to Nairobi in Kenya, a new test kit for bovine trypanosomiasis, or sleeping sickness as it's known in humans, is being demonstrated to vet Dr. Joseph Otieno. So for the bleeding, we'll do another one so that we don't stress this one too much. Dr. Otieno was voted Vet of the Year by the Kenya Veterinary Association in 2016. He also works with Kentec, the Kenya Tsetse and Trypanosomiasis Eradication Council. In cattle, the condition known as Nagana is a wasting disease spread by the bite of the tsetse fly. It causes prolonged suffering and often results in death. And it's hit the livelihoods of many cattle owners and their families in Africa. Identifying the disease can be a costly and time-consuming process. Now though, animal health company Siva Santé Animal has launched a new rapid diagnostic test kit that can detect trypanosomiasis from a small blood sample in just 10 minutes. It's the first test of its kind that's been developed for use in the field. We just need a simple, uh, a single drop of blood. So he'll draw the blood and then we'll proceed on and carry out the test uh, at the, the test table. So, Richard? Uh, it's a kit that is very ideal for African conditions where we don't have access to equipment and even personnel in regards to being able to use or to diagnose trypanosomiasis in a failed condition. Because at the moment currently, to diagnose trypanosomiasis, we primarily depend only on the clinical signs and the prevalence of disease in various regions. But the confirmation is only by taking blood back to the lab. So Verida came in very handy, uh, an innovation from SIVA, where you can actually take the kit to the field, you can take the kit to where the animals are, take a blood sample and actually confirm on the spot within 10 minutes that actually whether the animals are sick of the disease or not. Uh, and as far as the diagnosis is concerned as a practicing vet, uh, I want to say diagnosis has been a challenge because uh, I mean uh, in the field uh, you find that uh, you cannot do a lot of uh, uh, tests that we do to ascertain that we are dealing with trypanosomiasis. Maybe you may not be able to carry a microscope there or even if you carry it maybe there is no electricity or, uh, and therefore you cannot do that. So for a long time we've been waiting for if a rapid test can be developed and now that uh, CEF has developed one I think it will be very very important for us because uh, trypanosomiasis shares uh, clinical diseases with many other, uh, many other animal diseases. The animal that we've just tested, uh, me and uh, my colleague, we are thinking that it's suffering from trypanosomiasis because of the wasting, but we've done the test and it has turned out negative. So it means that if, we, if that test was available, then uh, it would be of great help to the diagnosis and treatment and effective treatment of the disease. Trypanosomiasis is a zoonotic disease. It spreads from animals to humans. The tsetse flies that bite cattle that are harboring the disease then go on to bite people. And many, including children, have died as a result. These patients are the lucky ones who are recovering after diagnosis. SIVA has supported the Stamp Out Sleeping Sickness campaign in Africa for many years. It's helped to fight the disease in both humans and animals. And now the World Health Organization says the number of human cases is reducing and eradication is possible by 2020. But disease in cattle is still a major problem. But being able to diagnose when the animals that are sick uh, using the kit, you're able to forego these losses and the farmers can benefit from the efforts they are putting to their farms towards getting more calves, getting more milk, getting healthy and fast growing animals. I think to a serious farmer, you will see that the cost uh, of the kit, vis-a-vis -vis the economic uh, losses that can be caused by the disease, it is still something that is worth trying. Following successful trials of Veridiag, Siva Santi Animal is now rolling out supplies of the test kit throughout African countries that are hit by trypanosomiasis.